what's up everybody welcome back to another episode there guys i am back today on beautiful pensacola pier so i'm gonna make my way down the pier a lot of you guys have commented in my few of my videos wanted some more pier action so that is exactly what i'm going to bring you guys on this week's episode so i'm gonna focus on some pier giants just got some reports my buddy here was early yesterday and he said they hooked on some big big fish so to me this is my favorite time to be fishing on the pier because you could just catch just about everything so i'm on my, my way down the pier show you guys what i'm using and hopefully hopefully i get on some fish for y'all but before that i want you guys to check out the beautiful weather out right there right now guys only bad part right now it is about 80 degrees to 90 i don't even know i'm already sweating just walking out of the pier so if it's your first time visiting my channel help me out hit the subscribe button if you guys enjoy this week's episode hit that thumbs up guys so enough talking i'm gonna get into it y'all let's go all right guys just getting here right now but before i said let me show you guys if you i don't know if you guys are seeing this right now but there is about a thousand thousand thousands of bait right now look at that right there it's just popping off everywhere it is summertime so what to me it is my favorite time to be fishing because you could just get just about everything on the pier especially when you have this much bait here there will be some big fish here so i'm gonna be showing you guys what i will be using today so let's go let's get into it okay so i'm using the sabiki rig right now um I am going to be fishing live bait because uh, as I was walking by, some of my subscribers are in to told me there's some big fish hiding under the bridge. So I'm going to catch some live bait, which is fairly easy. All I'm going to do is throw it out there right now in between the giant schools of bait right now, which is, won't be as difficult. Pop it one slow. There it is. It's already getting hit, guys. It's crazy. I mean, there it goes guys live bait there we go that's what we need right here here it is live bait right here ly is what we call it some guys call it pilchards this is the bait of choice for today and that's it we're gonna put it on the hook and i'll show you guys now what i'm gonna be doing all right guys we're on we're on a big boy oh my god we're on the big boy guys let's see if we take him out we're on i threw a live down ly oh Let's see if we take him out. He's trying to run to the pilings. That's what they're gonna do. If you there he is, guys. Oh, 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 there he is, guys. Monster red ran right into the pilings, guys. Look at that slot right there. That's not a slot, but a big bull red, guys. Whoo! Been a while since I've done this for you guys. I know you guys comment down below on my videos that you wanted me to come down to the pier. So I came out here look what we got anybody with a pier net ask anybody that has a pier net over there there it is guys right there big boy redfish on my pen battle 6000 with my frisky fin rod i'm just waiting for a net i did forget a net guys but hey was not prepared to come fishing today quick trip i wanted to come out here and see if i get on fish for y'all big nice redfish y'all I'll grab him. I'll grab him on the shoreline. Don't worry. I'll grab him. Don't worry. We might have to beach him, guys. Something I've done before on this channel. There he is, guys. Big bull red. Is it Shelby or bull red? Nah, that's a bull red, buddy. I had a landing pair net down there. Where you at? Where is it? Right there. You mind getting it? It's coming with it right now. Okay. Appreciate it, man. No, no. See if we bring him up, guys. See if we bring him up. He's already tired. You could tell he gave out on the first. Oh. <clears throat> pull up, pull up, pull up. There he goes, guys. Beautiful red. Look at that size of that thing. Good job. I told you they're gonna hit that first run and then oh, yeah. all you do is put pressure on them. Oh. oh. This might be close to a slap. We're gonna have to measure them to see. There we go guys. Right now, first one up. Beautiful 
redfish right now. We are gonna release them, but we're still gonna, are gonna measure them because you never know with these fish, if they're under 27, you could keep one per person. So we're gonna go ahead and measure and see what it is. Man, it might be a slot. Guys, 26 and a half. 26 and a half right there. Slot right here, boy. That's why we're getting started, guys. First one up. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna give it to this guy over there. Here you go, man. Here you go. Thank you, man. Where's your ice? Where's your chest? Right there. Oh, thank you so much, buddy. Thank you. Hey, oh, wow. That's my birthday gift. Okay, thank you. Is it what? It's your birthday? It's my birthday. Oh, there you go. Oh, thank it's you. meant to be. Thank you, buddy. Man, there you go. We live in Atlanta. We don't get those like that. Hey, listen, man. I just do this for fun, you know? I tell people all the time. Yeah. There you go, bro. Grab the net. Grab the net. There you go. Told you a hit. Oh, that's a big boy. A bull. That's a bull right there. There we go, guys. I told you I know why it work. Oh, pretty good in here or no? Nah, that's too big to keep. But if you're a slot, they're pretty good. You put them on the half shell on the grill. Mm-mm-mm. He's way too big. He's probably yeah. mid-30s. I think 34. I'm going to take my guess. What do you think? Yeah, I thought about a 12-pound fish. There you go, guys. Right there. That's still on a really nice red hat. Yeah, there was a pair sitting right here behind this pond that I just had to, I had to get them comfortable to my bait being there. Uh, that's why I like to side cast them uh -huh. in front and let the current take it into them. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's why I, I dropped that bait back here and put my lead right here and let that float back. Damn. Down. Big boy, guys. Look at that. There's two of them right there, guys. Right there. Another one right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. And we just saw another one. So there is a stack of school of redfish right now here. Right now, the net is stuck right now. Um, something happened with the net. So my buddies over there are going to run down. And I'm just going to take a picture with it. Quick release. We are going to let it go. I don't know if you guys can see it. But it's a big, big redfish, guys. There he is, guys. There he is right there. Big bull redfish. Already beached. Buddy's over there getting down there. He's gonna run down there, take a picture with him, and release him right quick. He's gonna take the hook out right now. As you can see right there, he's gonna take the hook out, then you throw him back, take a quick picture, and release him, guys. So, like I said, there he goes. He's taking a picture, and now he goes back into the water. Must have been about 34, 35 inches. There are some big fish I hide under these bridges guys so there he is he's releasing them right there there he goes live and healthy guys that's the point of fishing if you're not going to keep a fish look at this how much bait there is I mean this is just crazy right now covered in thousands of these right now it is summertime that's when you know it's summer when you got all these bait fish stacked under these bridge so you know what that means there's some big bridge monsters hiding under this pier y'all look at that wow Wow, but the water is clear, blue, beaches are packed. It is summertime, guys. Wow. Everywhere, look at that. Everywhere, guys. Down I'm gonna here. have one LY. Now that I just caught some, I'm gonna have one dead cut bait and one alive. Basically, what I'm using is 50 hook, 60 pound leader line, and a three ounce egg sinker. Like I said, I'm gonna have one rod with a live and one with a cut bait this way i see which one does get hit all i'm gonna be doing is casting in the bottom holy snap look how much macros look at that look at throw your jig throw your jig throw your jig here come here oh my god guys that is that is macros right there i'm sorry jack crevels guys by the hundreds here Hold it, see if it takes off, guys. Just look at how much jacks are here right now. 
threw out a spoon. Catch, get some red. My buddy got a red. Let's we'll see what I got now. I'm throwing the spoon now. Oh, it came off. All right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this week's episode. I did get on one, walked away, and lost an even bigger one. But um, guy next to me that I know personally um, hooked on a big, big one, as you guys see in the episode. So hope you guys enjoyed this week's episode. If you did, make sure you hit the thumbs up. We'll see you guys next week. Keep on fishing, guys.